Welcome to our channel. In this video, we'll explore how to create and send invoices in Odoo. We'll also cover vendor bills, payments, and integration with accounting. To create a new customer invoice, go to the accounting app, open the customers tab, select invoices, and click new. Here, choose the customer from the drop down list, specify the invoice date and payment terms due date. Add products or services with quantity, price, and taxes. This can be done using the catalog button, which opens a window for product selection. Once the form is filled out, click confirm. The invoice will be posted and Odoo will automatically generate the corresponding journal entries, which can be reviewed under the journal items tab. Confirming the invoice posts it to your accounting ledger, generating a unique sequence number. This integration ensures all financial data is recorded in real time. If changes are needed after confirmation, you can reset the invoice back to draft mode. To send the invoice to the customer, click send. The print and send window opens, defaulting to the customer's preferred delivery method. You can change it if needed or manually select send by email, download, or send by post. After clicking send, the invoice is emailed to the customer's registered address. All sent messages can be viewed in the communication history window. Isn't that convenient? Odoo also makes it easy to manage unapplied payments. If a customer has outstanding credits, the system displays a message. You have outstanding credits listed below for this customer. You can select an existing payment from the list and apply it directly to the invoice. To register a new payment, click the Pay button at the top of the invoice. In the pop-up window, select the payment journal and, if necessary, adjust the amount. Then, click Create Payment. The system marks the invoice as paid, and below you can view payment details such as date and amount. Now let's see how to work with vendor bills. Go to the Vendors tab, select Bills, and click New. Choose a vendor from a list, or create a new one directly within the bill. Next, enter the bill date and payment terms. We'll look later at how the system helps track these payment deadlines. To add products, Use the catalog button. This lets you review available items and add them to the bill with a single click. Double check that all data is correct, then click confirm. The bill will be posted and Odoo will automatically generate the necessary journal entries. The system also retrieves unapplied payments for the vendor and displays a message. You have outstanding debits listed below for this vendor. At the bottom, you can see any unmatched payments. To allocate one to the bill, just click Add. To create a new payment, click Pay. Adjust the payment journal or amount if needed, then click Create Payment. The bill will be marked as Paid and detailed payment information will appear below. In Odoo, you can also pay multiple bills at once. To see how this works, go to the Vendor section and open the list of bills. Select several bills from the same vendor. A Pay button will appear at the top. Click it to open the payment window, choose the payment journal, and verify the amount. If everything is correct, click Create Payment. The status of the selected bills will change to Paid. Quick and easy. To track overdue payments, Odoo provides two key reports under the reporting menu, Aged Receivable and Aged Payable. Aged Receivable shows outstanding customer invoices grouped into 30-day intervals. This helps monitor overdue payments and manage customer credit. Aged Payable displays unpaid vendor bills categorized by aging periods, enabling businesses to track obligations, manage cash flow, and maintain good supplier relationships. That's it. We've covered how to create and send customer invoices, manage vendor bills, register payments, and integrate all operations with accounting and Odoo. Thank you for watching and see you on our channel.